Do you think there's a difference between uh, wrestling that from you were there and what there is today? Uh, yeah, and I, I hear, and hear it from the fans and again, and I'm sure that I'll, you know, here at the Toy Fair today, I'm going to hear it as well from a lot of fans. And now the younger fans that don't have anything to compare it with, they just they became wrestling fans in the last couple of years. They're a fan of the product today. Well, they love what they see and what, and, and they're they're cool with that. But the older fans. A lot of them say, you know, it's just not the same. Like, you know, we, they, they, you know, I happen to be in that, that era, you know, uh, the late 80s, the early 90s, Hulk Hogan, Macho Man, Randy Savage, Jake the Snake, and the Million Dollar Man. Uh, and people say, you guys were the golden age. Those were the best years. Uh, and our era was one of probably the last generation to learn the industry the way that we did. And we developed our own characters as we went, and we had time. Today, it's become much more of a drama. I mean, uh, Monday Night Raw is a three-hour show now. And, uh, you know, most people say, well, it's, you know, it's like you know, two hours of talk and only about an hour of action. So, um, and of course, I'm not gonna knock that because I was at WrestleMania this year, and they set another record in another stadium. So they still have an enormous, not only nationwide, but global uh, audience. Uh, but so I don't want to be one of those old timers and say, oh, well, you know, these young whippersnappers. Uh -uh. I'm grateful for the run I had. Do I like wrestling the way it was? Obviously, because that was my generation and that was what I was comfortable with. Just one more thing. Yes. Everybody's got a price for the Million Dollar Man. <laughs>